Hello, ladies. You know the line, the legendary Old Spice ad. When we decided to test VO3.1, we didn't mean another scenery shot. We wanted to see if VO3.1 could keep up with the most confident man in advertising. We didn't just recreate this ad. We tracked every minute and every credit it burned. Watch till the end to see how long it took, what it really cost, and whether AI can compete with a full ad agency. We didn't pick this ad because it's famous. We picked it because it's impossible. Sets change mid-sentence, props morph in hand, and somehow, the actor never leaves frame. It's one of the most iconic, mind-bending commercials ever made. So instead of testing with another landscape or cinematic sequence, we rebuilt a full live-action ad, scene by scene, using nothing but prompts, no cameras, no crew, just VO 3.1 inside in video. So here's exactly how we built it, step by step. We started the same way every ad starts, with the hero and the product, except this time both were born from prompts. Inside Nano Banana, we generated our two main visuals, the product and the character. For the product, we used this prompt, and for the character, we used this prompt. That gave us our main actor and hero product, both photorealistic, ad-ready, and perfectly stylized for the Old Spice world. From here, it was all about building motion. Once we had our hero and product, we started generating the key moments, the shots that would make the ad feel alive. Inside Nano Banana, we recreated every major shot the original ad is known for, the boat, the shell, the diamonds, and finally, the horse. Each was built using detailed prompts like these. You can pause the video to read the full prompts. It'll show you how detailed you need to get for high quality results. Each prompt took roughly a minute to generate. And because InVideo gives you multiple generations per prompt, we could instantly pick the best shot and move forward. Then came the real test, bringing those stills to life. This is where everything came together. Once we switched to VO 3.1, the ad stopped being a series of images and started becoming motion. We began with the opening scene, attached the character image and used the ingredients feature to guide VO 3.1 through the first shot. VO 3.1 generated a perfect cinematic intro, confidence expression, natural camera movement, and that unmistakable Old Spice energy. And because everything was inside one in-video project, every generation, no matter the model, stayed in one place automatically. Then came the second shot. We attached the last frame of the first shot as our reference and added the product image. That gave us the first seamless product reveal. Clean motion, perfect framing, and eye contact that actually feels acted. Next was the toughest transition, the bathroom to the boat. We switched to VO 3.1 frames, attached the last frame of the bathroom as frame 1 and the wide boat shot as frame 2 and wrote this. And even though it didn't give us exactly what we had in mind, it gave us something better. Guess the AI's a fan of Old Spice too. Once we nailed the core transitions, the rest was about building momentum and keeping the magic consistent. We followed the same process for every other shot in the ad. Each time we took the last frame from the previous video as frame one and the new image from Nano Banana as frame two. That chaining method kept every movement fluid. The actor never jumped out of frame and the world around him just kept transforming. It's how you make an AI-generated ad feel like one continuous take. Once all the clips were ready, we brought them into DaVinci Resolve. You can do the same in Premiere Pro. We lined up every shot by matching the first and last frames, then added smooth cut or morph transition effects to erase any micro jumps. The result? Perfectly seamless scene changes, all generated without touching a real camera. For the voice, to make sure it sounded the same throughout the video, we exported the audio of all the scenes together in one audio file. We then used Eleven Labs Voice Changer, so every line sounded consistent, like one confident narrator. Music came from YouTube Music, picked to match that dramatic, tongue-in-cheek Old Spice tone. Once the sound and visuals were synced, the ad finally felt complete, cinematic, confident, and completely AI-built. The full recreation took about five hours and around $26 worth of credits for the shots you see in the final ad. We did a few reruns to get every transition just right, bringing the total to roughly $72. But the real takeaway wasn't the cost, it's what it revealed, that creativity isn't limited by budget anymore, only imagination. For us, recreating this wasn't imitation. It was proof that anyone can now bring bold ideas to life with the kind of polish that once needed million-dollar budgets and massive crews. Whether you're a creator, marketer, or business owner, 
This workflow makes high-end video production fast, affordable, and entirely possible. Because with VO 3.1 inside NVIDIA, you're not just generating visuals, you're directing commercials. Thanks for watching, and if you want to see how we keep pushing the limits of storytelling with AI, make sure you subscribe.